Yeah, so we siphon the gas out of these cars. Whoa! Oh man, look out! Oh my god! Oh man! Let's double tap him. I don't want him getting back up. Here they come! It's the northeast! Blast him! <laughs> All right, guys, and gals, and survivors, etc. Welcome to Don't Bite to Me, Bro. I just found this over on itch.io. And it caught my eye. I was sniffing around looking for something new to play on the channel here to share with you guys. And the title was very intriguing to me and also the aesthetic, which is a low poly, voxely looking world. It's like an open world zombie apocalypse game with some uh, tower defense thrown in for good measure. I've been playing it now for about 30 minutes and it's quite a bit of fun. So we're going to share it here in a minute. But first things first, let's get the nitty gritty out of the way. Again, this is Don't Bite Me Bro. It's on itch.io. I'll put a link down below in the description. It's made by Moy Fuego. It is free, but you can throw some money at the developer if you like. Um, it's made for... I'm pretty sure I saw... Win uh, obviously Windows. I'm playing on a Windows. But I'm pretty sure I saw a Mac and a Linux download there as well. But don't quote me on that. Just check it out for yourself if you have one of those uh, systems and you're curious about it. All right. I think we are done. Let's jump in and get started. Don't bite me, bro. So it's an open world zombie apocalypse game where you have to build up a, a base and defend it from zombie hordes that come every couple of minutes. And you have to gather resources out in the world. Uh, and you also meet people and try to collect them, save them. So this is my game right here that I already have in progress. I got up to herd 7. So I played for 35 minutes. But let's start from scratch. Let's go right from the gate. Out of the gate. Here we go. There's a bit of a cutscene here. So... You get to see the, kind of the uh, the graphic style and the art style. It's really cool. So this is the, the little village. Right now, everything's happy. Everybody's going about their business. And oh, gosh, what is this then? Something hurling toward Earth is my guess. But nobody has any idea. Look at all those lemmings. Not even talking to one another. Completely ignoring each other. Maybe looking at their smartphones. <laughs> going to work. Going to school. Uh, whatever. And small town, one mile that way. That's I think that's where we start in the small town. So there's Earth. Cubicle Earth. Big city, one mile away. And here's everybody in the town square dancing. Such a happy day. And oh, not so happy anymore. And there's a ball that rolls into a hospital. There's a ball that rolls by a guy in a church. And one that goes into a cave. These are showing some of the more interesting locations in there. Now everybody's a zombie. Okay, this is us getting that little red pickup and driving off and running down <laughs> Zed's on the way. Awesome! I love my little red pickup. What's better than that, huh? Alright. That's the intro, and there's a very large bone here. Just ignore the big bone. Let's go talk to the man. That's our car where we just crash. Quick! Follow me! Says the old Kaja. Alright, we're right behind you, fella. Oh, man, he just knocked that bone right out of the way. He's a tough old coot. All right, right on you, fella. W glad what? Glad to meet you, too. My camp is up ahead. All right. Oh, it's a lovely camp. Dang it! They got through again! Yeah, it looks that way. Sorry, so we're going to pick up on this wood right over here. We're going to follow the uh, swearing old man. Join me when you're ready. All right, I just click one of these. There we go. It's a four up to four-player co-op game, which would be pretty interesting. I could sure use some help. The dead ones that broke my walls are still around here. All right. It, we're, we're the right guy for the job, that's for sure. There they are, on the outskirts. So this gives you a look at uh, all the controls. Isn't it really not very much? Uh, so yeah, we can do that. Swing, swing away. Kill the buggers! All right, let's go get them. Smash right through that fence. This, this has to be fixed anyway, so we'll take that down. <laughs> all right, here we go. Click to attack. So we have a baseball bat. That's about it. Wham, wham. Oh, he got me. Oh, now we're a little hurt. This is our health up there. That little red dot is health. The other one appears to be... Like our um, stanima. All right, we're done here. I think we, we have eliminated the threat. And old Kai just says, collect four to three pieces of wood from the trees. All right, we can do that. So let's whack some trees. Let me get these planks right out of them. Easy peasy. He's following us around, telling us exactly what we have to do. Listen, I don't need you to be my supervisor, man. Looking over my shoulder makes me nervous. Collect 18 pieces of wood. He's counting down every piece, isn't he? <laughs> All right, we're almost there. Eight more pieces of wood. Dude, you're giving me performance anxiety. Stop it. Three more. Oh my gosh, this guy. All right, so now we have all the pieces that we, he wanted us to collect and we go put them in the storehouse. So let's go do that right now. Wham, grab that one too. Just walk over here to the storehouse and chuck them in like magic. 
And now we have, whoop, got lots. Okay, now we're gonna do some building, so I'm gonna hit the shift and show this man that we know what to do. Build a wall and repair the fence. All right, so hold down shift and then you can go scroll through all the items you can build. We're gonna go with the wall, which is five, wood, planks, and we hit space bar to bring it up. And we can actually rotate this thing and move it around and so forth and so on, but we're gonna place it right here in the opening. That seems like the logical thing to do. And here he's checking, he's, look, he's watching us. He's watching us like a hawk. There we go, how we doing, old man? And repair the other wall. Okay, we got it. Let's just take all these down. Oh, gosh, darn it. I, I hope <laughs> that wasn't his. Uh, and bam, there. All right, the wall's done. Build four spikes anywhere around the camp. All right, now we got to build four spikes, which means we need some wood. Right now, we don't have to worry about the horde. The time is uh, not counting down, but sooner or later, we're going to get a horde when we're done with the old man here. All right, so let's build uh, spikes, right? Which is right there, spikes, space. And then these we're gonna rotate like so. I'll put, uh, we'll just start over here. Space there. So space, and that's one, we need one more. The uh, controls are a little wonky. I, I imagine I could use a controller, but I'm a keyboard and mouse kind of fella. All right, oh man, you coming in? Oh, he's in, he goes right through the fence, wow. Over it or under it or something. Upgrade some walls. All right, now we got to upgrade the walls. So let's upgrade the walls by the gate. Just walk up to it and press E, and it costs 10 wood. And we're going to upgrade a few of these walls. As many as we can. And he's right on our tail again, watching every movement. Collect three pieces of wood from the trees. Okay. Now, I think the whittle trees only give us whittle wood, so we got to get the bigger trees to be more efficient. I find that the pickup truck is the best way <laughs> to knock down the trees. <laughs> well, we'll get, we'll probably get to that soon. All right, fella, how we doing? Oh, upgrade some more walls, he says. All right, let's grab a little bit more wood here. You might as well do this while the timer is not counting down. We don't have to worry about the horde because once that starts, it never stops. And then you're always under the gun. So now would be a pretty good time, I think, to just grab as much wood as possible. These trees do grow back, by the way. I've seen them sprout out of the ground a couple of times. Oh, look, the bodies of the zombies are still here. Pretty cool. All right, let's let's see. Let's get like a hundred. I'm thinking a hundred ought to do. This guy's getting impatient, though. I can tell. Okay, I think we lost him. Oh no, here he comes. Upgrade some walls, dang it! All right, last one. Last one. We're over a hundred. A hundred planks, old man. All right, let's let's get out of here. Come on, let's go. Upgrade some more walls. Okay, I think we lost him. No, he's still there. Dang it, we can't get rid of this guy. Upgrade this one. And you must be starved. Okay, we did all the walls that he wanted us to do. And yes, we are starved. So we can eat something right here by the fire. Press the E key. And that heals us up. And this shows us what we have in storage. Let's throw that wood in there so I'm not carrying it around. You can still build from wood in the, uh, in the bin here. Break open that bullet box. Learn to defend yourself. All right, let's go defend yourself. This is a bullet box. It took me 20 minutes to find a bullet box. That, that looks like a health potion. Just saying. But I'll whack it anyway. All right, so now we got bullets. So it is right click to aim, left click to shoot. So let's, yep, I know. Gotta pick them up. Pick them up. Dude, I know. Let me get them. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, we gotta shoot all the bottles. What are they there for? And I wanna pick up these stragglers. Can I get them? Thank you. Before they disappear. Herd one! I have a feeling the herd will be back soon! Yeah, here they come. So a herd is approaching, and this is a little timer thing. There's only two, so it's not really much of a herd. And we can get inside here and defend it from the inside, and we don't take any damage when we're inside, but we can damage them. We can reach them through the fence, which is pretty darn awesome. Where'd the old man go? Get in here! Dude, get in follow me. You follow me everywhere when I'm working, and now you're gonna stand outside the gates and the fence. Oh, boy. Not the sharpest tool in the shed. All right, where are they, where are they at? They're kind of slow. Oh, here they come. Here they come! Save my ammo for later for town. We need it. And these guys just, just smash them. Dead! Clear! It's clear, old man. Sometimes they drop bones. And you get these bones down here? I'm not really sure what the bones are for yet, but I do collect them when I can. Let's gather resources before they return! I saw a weird shape fly north of here when the thing landed. Maybe it can stop all this. I think that's the cave, is what he's talking about. Be careful out there! The dead can't be anywhere! Alright, so we hit tab to see the map. 
This is where we are right now. That is our little house, and there's our red pickup truck. Whoa, where'd it go? Oh, man. Oh, my gosh. You can find food in these barrels and then get some gas from the trucks and cars. Yeah, yeah so we siphon the gas out of these cars. Whoa, oh, man, look out. Oh, my God. Oh, man. Uh -huh. They killed old man. <laughs> it's terrible. Let's double tap him. I don't want him getting back up. All right, that, that's actually scripted. You lose the old man, and now, oh my gosh, all right, grab the food and grab some gas. We still have time before the horde shows up, so let's go grab. Uh, there's a woman over here. we got to go help her before she gets turned. And if you don't help these people soon, quickly enough, they do actually get turned. Uh, wait a minute, where is she? Does she show up on the map? Yeah, I don't know. There's some people around. Maybe they get moved around. I, I could have sworn I met a lady up there. Oh, no, I think this is one of them. You can save people in the town. But they can get turned like that one there. Oh, dang it. Oh, dang it. Now, this is a police station, but it's locked. So my guess is we're going to have to get a key somehow. And we'll be able to load up with some ammo. All right, where's that lady? We, got, we do have to get back before the herd shows up. But let's see if there's any survivors around. We can bring them back. I'm going to grab this gas while we're here. Oh, full. All right, we got a full tank. Uh... Is that her? Ma'am? Oh no, I think that's her! Oh no, 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 this is a... Oh, this is really gross. This, she's pregnant. That little baby zombie popped out. That's nasty. Alright, let's get out of here. That is nasty. We gotta get home. We gotta get back to the base. We gotta protect the base. There are four zombies coming in this little herd. We should be okay. Uh, there we go. We got our spikes. We got our walls. And I think we beat the zombies here, so we should be fine. I'm going to eat a piece of food, though. Heal it up! Mmm! Mmm-mm! Bring it on! I don't know which way they're coming from. Oh my gosh, they came right in the gate! <laughs> Whoops! Get out of my corn! Uh. Uh. One left, right? Yeah, one left. Just going to through the gate. He couldn't find the gate. Good. All right, we got two, three bones! Herd 3 is coming. Now, see, it starts down here. It comes all the way up. It's really slow. we got plenty of time. I'm not too worried about it. But we might as well... Let's do some upgrading while we're here. we got plenty of wood. Let's get all the walls upgraded. All right. We can't do the whole base, but we got quite a bit of it done. And now, let's go gas up. Well, the, the car's already gassed up. But I'll show you... Um, where's our truck? I'll show you how... Whoa! There it is show you what I do to take the trees down, how, how awesome this is. Yeah. I do have my, my gun is loaded. I have some ammunition, but yeah. I'll save it. Ow! Ooh, you got me. You got me. All right, so we climb in, and we drive. This is the best. <laughs> oh, wait. Bone. And I wish I knew how to spend those bones. I don't know yet. Oh! Driving this thing is just insane. All right. Uh, let's see. We can, we can run these guys down, which is pretty awesome. You do actually have to have some good speed going. <laughs> but it's crazy. Yeah. I want to try to find a survivor, and then we can lead them back and maybe have them give us a hand. Yeah, so this is what you do. You just run down trees, and the planks just fall right out. It works way better in the woods. All right, how are we doing for the herd? Oh, we still got a few more minutes. Ugh. Oh, didn't see you there. Sorry. Yeah, let's just head back, and we're going to run over a few of these trees right here. I don't think the car actually gets damaged. It's just, it doesn't have any, it doesn't look like it has any health. Unfortunately, you do actually have to leave the car to pick up the planks. So that's the only drawback. All right, the herd is on the way. I don't think they do any damage to the car. I'm not sure. I've never seen them do any damage to the car. You can't build during the attack either, unfortunately. See, under attack, won't let me build. All right, we've got six in this herd approaching. And health looks pretty good. As long as we stay behind the walls, we'll be fine. Now, it looks like they chewed up this piece of uh, my plot here, my corn plot. But I'm, I'm fairly certain we can rebuild that. I think I saw that in the build menu. We can grow, we can grow corn and stuff in here. I'm not really sure how to pick it. All right, we got a bone out of it. Nice. One to go. Whammo! All right, let's upgrade it while we're here. Yep, that's exactly my thoughts as well. And herd, f we're up to herd four now. That's I think it saves right after the herd, that last herd. Whoops. Get some all out of wood. Let's go get some more wood and just finish up that wall. 
So eventually I'll have to get all spikes all the way around. And then we can start building some towers. But we, I think we need to find other survivors. I'm not sure if they actually man the towers or anything. But I have bumped into some survivors in my first game. Um, and I think you can unlock them as characters to play. Maybe maybe that's how it works. I don't know. I don't know. All right, let's... Uh, how about if we throw down a couple of spikes over here? Eventually, we'll get it all the way around. Spikes. All right. Excelente! We've got plenty of food. Uh, should we even bother taking the car? I'm going to save the car for the city. There is actually, like, you can go all the way here to the city. We'll save the car and the gas for that. Yeah. Uh, we can just walk over here and look around. I don't know what we're looking for. I got food and gas. Well, the gas is just about full, but we can still siphon some here. Whoop, sucked it right out. But I'm surprised we haven't run into any survivors yet. Oh, cheeseburgers! Grab them up. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I don't see any survivors around. Maybe they, yeah. they returned and we, we didn't save yeah. them, which is a shame. Yeah. Oh, the herd's coming. We gotta go. We gotta go. Yeah. Oh, man. We're, we're pretty far. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. oh, I tried body slamming him, but it didn't really work. I just got bit faster. <laughs> okay, a herd of eight. We might have to use our bullets is here. Inside. Here we go. Herd approaches. Made it just in time. Um, I'm going to eat something real quick because I'm a little bit injured. Got eight Zeds on the way. Now, hopefully they come from this angle and they'll walk into my spikes and die. But that's usually never the case, is it? Murphy's Law. Oh, here they come, here they come. Southeast, from the southeast. Blast him! All right, that's enough blasting. Let's just use a bed from here on. I'm gonna save those bullets for when I really, really, really need them. Because they're pretty hard to come by. All right, let's uh, let's make a few more spikes before we head back into town. I really want to find a survivor. Let's see what they're capable of. All right, what else can we make? A trap. Ooh. That seems kind of fun. Let's try a trap. Oh, it's big. Let's put a trap right in front of the gate. Right there. It only costs five wood, which seems like a bargain. And let's put some spikes around it. One there. I keep hitting the wrong button. There. All done. So, ten approaching in this herd. Maybe we can take a quick run into town. I don't know if the people in the town yeah. of survivors, like, just spawn in randomly. Or if once they're gone, they're gone. I'm not really sure about that. But there's clearly nobody here. Yeah. And there is a herd approaching, so I don't want to go too far right now. Alright, here they come. Ten approaching this time. This could be bad. Hopefully they come toward the spikes. Here they come from the northeast. I knew it. Of course they're coming from the northeast. Instead of the way I want them to come. So I'm going to blast a few with the gun. Oh, I shot the dead guy. And I'm out of ammo. So that's it. So now it's down to the baseball bat. Which works quite well, to be perfectly honest. Now, we can do some upgrading here. We can change characters as well. And I think when you find the survivors out there, you can um, you unlock them and then you can be them or something. You can switch to them? I don't know. Here, let's select this guy. Alright, so now we're Ginger Man. Let's eat some food. And can we build... Oh, we can build corn. Let's put some corn in here. Right there. Whoops! Uh, well, we built a plot, but how do we actually... Maybe the corn's just going to grow naturally there eventually? I'm not sure. Oh, we can grow trees. Interesting. Alright. I thought the trees grew back on their own. I could have sworn I saw them pop up out of the ground, but maybe, maybe not. Maybe not. Uh, you want to go to the cave? Let's go to the cave. It's right here. Ugh, get in there. So this loads up a, uh, a separate, like, dungeon instance. And we have, we have some ammo here, which is nice. And there's a campfire here in case we get hurt. And this is just food. Yeah, extra food. All right, we're going in. And now we fight. 
Oh, and we can't get out until we kill them all. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to be a little more cautious. Oh, get a little cray cray here. Ooh. But if these, now these guys are a little different than the other zombies, aren't they? They seem a little, they look a little different. Yeah. All right, grab that bone. Grab that bone. Still not sure what the bones are for. And by the way, we can actually build inside yeah. here, so you can put spikes and stuff down if you want. Come on, zombie! Ah, get wrecked! Yeah. Last one. Last one for free. Okay, now we can either move on that way, I think, but I don't want to go that way because the herds. Oh wait! Oh, did the herd freeze? It looks like the herd might have paused while we're here inside the cave. That's cool. So maybe we'll go yeah. over there. Whoa! Oh gosh, okay. <laughs> you do that. Too late, we're committed, we're in now. Ooh, these guys are tough. He took three shots instead of the, the usual yeah. two. Mm. Maybe even four. Dang it. Yeah. Huh. Alright, we got it. We got this. We got it! And grab them bones. And I really yeah. wish I knew what those bones are for. Maybe you guys know. If you do know what the bones are for, please put it down in the comments. I haven't really investigated it. Yeah. All right. There are more tunnels have been opened, but I think I'm just going to leave now. So we got a couple of uh, tunnels open, and we'll check them out another time. Hopefully that did actually freeze that herd. We'll see. Oh, somebody just broke a bottle. Yeah, so the herd does stop when you're inside the cave. That's a nice touch. Good. So you can spend all day long in there if you want, as long as you're healthy enough. All right, I'm gonna grab some wood with my pickup truck, and then uh, I think we're gonna call it quits for now. Woohoo! <laughs> this is great. <laughs> Look at that. That's amazing. And we'll get through one more herd because that'll save the game. Oh, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab, 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 grab before it all goes. And then we'll we'll uh, we'll be done with this episode, and we'll uh, we'll just pick up the next episode. Let's get inside. Heal up. All right. 12 coming this time, but we did get some ammo from the cave, so we should be able to survive this wave. And hopefully they come from the west. They haven't come from the west yet. That's where all my spikes are, dang it. All right, nothing yet. Here they come! It's the northeast! Blast him! <laughs> Ooh. I missed that guy. All right, keep blasting. Yes, that'll do it. We really, we really need to get into that police station so we get some more ammunition. Just have to find the key. All right, we made it. We done did it. Oh wait, there's one left. What? Oh, one straggler. Really now? You're late. Huh. Clear. All right, that's it for now, guys. Don't bite me, bro. Link down below. It's on itch.io. Check it out. And I will be continuing this most likely. Let me know if you want to see more. Leave a like on the video and, a, and or a comment or both. And uh, let me know how you feel about that. All right. See you guys soon. Bye-bye.